Zometry's manufacturing technologies explained. Stereolithography. Stereolithography, or SLA, is a resin-based process that creates high-resolution solid parts by curing liquid photopolymer resin layer by layer with a laser. Unlike extrusion-based methods, SLA produces parts with smooth surfaces and intricate details, making it ideal for applications requiring precision and complexity. SLA technology can be more expensive than other plastic 3D printing methods due to material resin costs and equipment overhead. While it produces detailed parts, they may not be as strong as thermoplastics. SLA primarily uses liquid photopolymer resins in various formulations, such as standard, flexible, tough and high temperature. Industrial SLA printers provide larger build volumes, higher precision and a wider range of materials, enabling the production of functional prototypes, end-use parts and intricate structures with exceptional accuracy and repeatability. In contrast, desktop SLA printers are compact, affordable and user-friendly. While they have limited size and material options, they still deliver excellent detail, making them ideal for hobbyists, small businesses and individual creators. An SLA printer consists of a resin tank, a build platform, a scanning mirror, an ultraviolet laser system and a recoder. The laser system is controlled by precise motors that move it along the X and Y axis to solidify the resin, while the build platform moves along the Z axis to build the part layer by layer. Industrial stereolithography typically uses a system where the build platform is submerged into the resin, leaving a thin layer of liquid between the build platform or the previous layer. Galvanometers direct the UV laser downward, tracing the cross-section of the 3D model and selectively curing the resin. As each layer, less than 100 microns thick, is formed, the part is lowered and a fresh layer of resin is recoated on top, ready for the next layer to be cured. Support structures are printed alongside to stabilise overhangs and complex geometries. Once the print is complete, the part is removed from the build platform, any uncured resin is cleaned off and support structures are removed. The part is then post-cured, typically in a UV oven, to improve its mechanical properties. Further finishing operations, such as sanding or painting, may be performed for final use. Let's recap what we've learned from this video. SLA uses a variety of photopolymer resins. It produces parts with smooth surface finishes and high resolution. SLA 3D printing is good for producing intricate models and detailed prototypes. Zometry, where big ideas are built.